Hi everybody, this is another family ornament. Again, very easy to do. Here are supplies. Uh, you can make the stockings any color that you like. Now I've been starting with cutting the hook so that when you're at that point or you feel you need to put it in, it's ready for you. We're going to start by rolling out the stockings. Now don't make them too flat. You don't want you don't want them really flat. After I made this ornament, I realized it probably would have been better if I had done a backing sheet for this. So if you want to do a, a thin backing sheet to put the stockings on and then trim around it, it might make your ornament a little bit stronger. Now we will be putting the white top on the stockings, so you really want to space them out a little bit. Now you see how I did not attach the green to the red? That's because I'm leaving some space for the white. And I did the same there. Now you see what I mean? If you had a backing sheet for this, it it might work out a little better. I don't know why I didn't do it, but you can do the backing sheet if you like. And if you've probably seen me do it in some of the other videos, then you would just trim around. I don't know why the light is flashing. This has happened in some of the videos and it wasn't flashing when I made the video. So I, I don't know what causes that, but I'm still learning. I'm getting there, hopefully. Now, this is where you put the names when you personalize. Now my six stockings, that my parents have six grandchildren, and these are the names of all their grandchildren. My contribution to the grandchildren was Matt. Now this piece of white, this is where I, I'm going to put Santa's head. So I did put a little backing for Santa's head. And as always, don't flatten his head. Keep it nice and round. And I have many different ways that I make Santa's beard. I decided on this one here, but you can make the beard any way you like.
Santa's arm reaching around, and we're going to be making a candy cane rope that kind of goes down around the stockings. And you've made this hat many times if you've been following the videos. Very easy to do. Make sure you press everything on. And of course, you can make this one with as many stockings as you want. There's our candy cane rope. And if this is your first video, to make the candy cane rope, just roll out a rope of white, a rope of red, squeeze them together, and twist. That's how we do our candy canes and the candy cane rope. Very simple. Now in this one, Santa is wearing black gloves. And I'm making a little indentation to show his thumb. So he's not wearing gloves, he's wearing mittens. And his cuffs. I know I should be talking more here, but I think if you watch it, you know what to do. Now, when you make the mustache, you can also score it before you add it to his face. And this is what I mean by scoring. or texture it, you know, whatever you want to call it. And his nose. And we're going to make a star. And I think I've told you before, uh, star cookie cutters are a very good investment. They're not expensive. You can find them anywhere. They're almost essential if you're going to make Christmas ornaments. And of course, this is where we will put the year. And you can put the star anywhere on the candy cane rope. And be careful when you add it that you don't cover too much of the white, because remember, you have to put the names into the white areas of the stockings. So you want to keep as much space as you can in those areas. And of course, the holly berries, holly leaves and berries. It's the little details that make all the difference. And it doesn't take that much time.
And of course, add your blush before you bake. I like to put a little bit on Santa's nose because he's been out in the cold riding in that sleigh. So you know his nose is going to be a little bit red. And here I am showing you the finished ornament, but it's not really finished. We need to put the hanger in. Uh oh, I remembered. <laughs> and you see what I mean about the back. It would have been nice to have had the stockings on a backing. I think my voice feels sounds a little rough this morning, but I'm doing this very early in the morning. So haven't had my coffee yet. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. We'll be going on to the next one soon. Bye.